Hello everybody, this is Havoc and welcome back to Napoleon Total War, continuing our Ottoman campaign. In the last episode, we were besieged by Russia, Jakob Petrovic Kolniv. We have, um, we do have, well, I thought we had superiority, I guess this army isn't reinforcing. Uh, we do have a lot of cavs, so we're going to kind of do the same tactics. We do have our Genissary Musketeers, which I think uh, pretty much hold up. Yeah, these guys have a higher accuracy as well. So I think we will be able to win this. It's just a manner of getting the right things, doing the right kind of flanks, and getting the job done. Pretty Should be a pretty simple battle. And from this point, we should be able to, our economy strong enough, we should be able to move on from this and start taking other places of the Russians and finally maybe get a hand on this war <laughs> and start being able to go back on the offensive again. It's been a very, very frustrating uh, handful of episodes. Don't like always being on the offensive, or on the defensive, rather. Sometimes it just can't be helped, but if at all possible... I prefer not being on the uh, defensive. Let's see. Hmm. Really isn't any good area. I guess we could do it right here. And then have... Oh man, they really don't spread out, do they? Two over there. Two over here. And then we're going to try and draw their line out over here. That's not a fence that we can officially get behind. Nope. This would be, though. It would almost be worth it to get these walls. Maybe come back a little bit and kind of use this position here as a good. I mean, the town, it's not like there's a capture point or anything like that. And there are more walls over here. Interesting. Let's just do this then. We'll do that. This guy will get over here and hold that part of the flank. Uh, I still think we could hold. Nope, it's up on a, oh, hmm. No, I want, I want, I want over here. That's no bueno. Um, and that's just all covered. That's not a good idea. I'm just gonna have it the way it was. Sure, it'd be nice to use those as uh, as a nice little cover advantage, but it's just not gonna work. Nope, we'll just keep it like that. We'll be alright. Start the battle. Hit the arty. Brilliant. Already took down one of them. This is their only piece of artillery as well, so we would definitely have tactical superiority if uh, we can get that thing knocked out. Bye, when ready. Here comes another salvo. Oh, that's terrifying to look at. Ha 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 ha. 
Look at that accuracy. I bet they're gonna try and get up on there, or they're gonna retreat. Say, uh uh, this ain't worth it. Oh no, they're setting up. Nope, <laughs> they just can't decide between wavering and. Here comes another salvo. Good lord, they're sniping these dudes. Oh, this is crazy. Alright. Snipes the general. Let's see what madness happens when we do this next salvo. I don't think these guys are going to come back. It's possible they might, but... Here we go. I don't even think they were aiming for that guy. These guys can't get in square formation. We'll just have to hope that they're able to uh, to get the job done. Uh, should I hold formation, let them try and get one more salvo off? Or should I switch to canister shot is the question. I'm ready. Yeah, those guys aren't coming back. Kind of resetting their fire at will status. That way they'll kind of do whatever they need to do. Huzzah! Here's their general. We'll see if we can't do anything against him in just a little bit. Kind of got a really good advantage there. They got some more of the horsemen. That's fine with me. Is there anyone else I can hit? They're all coming into range now. We are going to try and... Take out their general. And then we're going to put in canister shot, probably. Here very, very soon. There we go. Took out some troops there. Alright, let's uh yeah, let's go ahead and do canister shot. Let's see what happens. It's not gonna be super effective at this range, but Well, I I I take that back. It's actually quite effective at this range. Come on, you got to do something, man.
I mean, it's not being as effective as it could be at a much shorter range. But it is still very, very effective. And uh, we're about to be overwhelmed. Don't worry, we'll take out their general. There we go. There we go. Ow. Run, run, run. It's hurt. Huzzah! Huzzah! Ow! Oh, that's a good one. We'll, we'll ignore this charge. And we'll focus on this one instead. Nope, you can't get in square formation fast enough. Are they not dying? Our men are running. Where? Where? Oh, come on, guys. There we go. Get in here. Sir, sir, our is under I don't I don't doubt that. Here we go. Hold that front line. Enemy general's been killed. That is very good for us. I'm holding in here. I probably shouldn't. I probably should have gotten out because I, if I remember right, the cav thing doesn't necessarily work as awful as it does in previous titles or in later titles, I guess. Length inside. Where are my cannons? Go, go, go. Here we go. Come on, men. We have lost quite a bit of our cab forces. But it's expected. I use cav in this game like I shouldn't use cav. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be honest here. This is not the antiquities. This is not the right way. Go faster, please. Our men are running, sir. Yeah, it doesn't surprise me. They didn't get there fast enough. These guys just gotta be getting shredded, though. Those guys have routed. Those guys are routing. These guys are still routing. So we're gonna hunt them down. I'm gonna get out of melee, get my general in the mix. 
soon to be yours. Yep. Huzzah. Plenty of friendly fire, I can already tell. Come on back, we got enough guys to run this dude. That dude's routing. Awesome. Now it's time to hit the bombard status because I don't want to, um... Actually, we'll just limber up. There we go. Please come around. Please hit this dude in the flank. We're going to let these guys kind of duke it out. Super fast forward time. I mean, that's 60 troops. I could really have not an extra 60 troops on the battlefield for the next battle. Oh, no, we'll continue. Are you kidding me? There's a lot of troops over here. What we got? What we got? Only 14, but hey, 14 is 14. Rounding them up swimmingly well. Russians didn't stand the chance. Come on. No, I'm gonna I'm pretty much destroying everyone I can. Everyone that I can. What about you, dude? You going after these guys? You are good. Overkill, absolutely. Necessary. Oh yeah, I think so. I'm really just sick of the Russians. Ready to move on with my life, conquer them, and then turn my eyes towards the east, or the west? The west. Okay, we're done. It's a close victory indeed. Um, so we lost 1,200. Only about 70 to friendly fire, which really isn't that bad. They friendly fired the crap out of themselves. And that doesn't even include this army right here, I don't think. Mm, Spain's invading Sicily. Technological advance, mass mobilization, minus 5% army upkeep. Uh, what are we researching now? Let's turn it over to here. This place is recovering though, right? Two turns, okay. Recruitment across the board. Oh, so this was the army. Oh, okay. Well, let's venture out. Hurrah, hurrah. Uh, we need some cav. So let's go ahead and recruit up some cav, can we? Oh, yeah. Got some deli horsemen. That'll work for me. We're just going to sit here over in here because we are going to start taking that area. Recruiting up. Uh, let's get our deli horsemen. Some deli lancers. Oh, never mind. 
Well, no, because we are going to split up anyways. Recruitment. Holy crap. I forgot about this place. It's so amazing. Okay, so we're going to come here. And then I forgot that these are regulars. Oh, my word. There we go. Do you still want to surrender? No, we'll continue the siege. That's two turns of a battle I don't necessarily have to take. I'm not gonna. That, ain't, that isn't worth it to me. Uh, we have 38 gun frigate. How much are we making a turn? 9,700. A small star fort. Not super sure if that's worth it. The Court of Justice, we could change this to a different building type. I don't know. I, I think this could be okay as a border town. A drill school, though, that would be pretty good. Provincial Sapahi, Circassian Mounted Swordsman. We still have that. A lot of those guys would get to tier 2, though, which would be pretty sweet. Is this even worth it? Plus 3 to replenishment. I can see that. What if I change this? A tax office? I really don't think that's necessary. Let's just do it, change it to a theater. These guys aren't necessarily going to be in the crap anymore. Um... Athens, we need to do stuff with you. Okay. So we have this magistrate, which gives us 10% bonus region tax. Recruitment capacity increases as well. Whoa, come on. Go here, and I'm going to do a theater because that will increase my uh, national prestige. A cannon foundry or army encampment? I really don't even feel like an army encampment is necessary. Uh, great estates would actually be a really good thing for us. Um, could do clearances as well over here. A supply depot would be fantastic. That's what I need to do. Uh, so we'll wait till next turn and we'll get into that supply depot. The uh, Russian rebels have taken the northern, that, uh, whatever it's called. Uh, join the war against the Austrian Empire. They will give us a carronade, bottling, and canning, army corps organization. And poverty control. Oh, no, 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 no. I just don't want to get into that just yet. Now, admittedly, the Austrians only have two regions. They want to fight it? We're not going to... We don't have enough time to fight this battle. We'll auto-resolve it. We only lost 915. They only have 288 men remaining. And the Russians are moving on. Who's this? The Kingdom of Sicily. Oh, well, that's rude. Oh, you're going to come after me again. So what do you have? Let me look at you. You have a 32-gun frigate, several 32 guns. Fine. Good job. You destroyed trade ships. Congratulations, Sicily. Oh, okay. Okay, I see how you are. That's fine. You're screwed. I'm going to kill you. Unless Spain does it first. Nope. Uh, diplomacy joined war against the uh, Naples. Give me a tech. Alright. Two fleets have been destroyed. Ah, I'm not going to do this yet. 
someone was asking about a naval battle. I want to give you guys a naval battle. So we have a 74, 24, two 38s, and a 26. I know they have a 24. They have several 24s. But I think my 74 gunship of the line would be... Do, they, are there, do we have mercenaries? Let's enlist an admiral. That'd cost a pretty penny, but... Yeah. That might help us out a little bit. We're going to construct a supply depot. That'll give us a 22% increase. Which I think would be very, very favorable. Let's go ahead and get some more of these guys as well. And then... Look at this, guys. Ridiculous. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Seems like sometimes the zoom doesn't want to work right. Uh, let's demand their surrender. We will peacefully occupy. And then I'm going to come out and kill them anyways. So we'll sit here and recruit for a little bit. The Balkan Rebels, that's someone we're going to have to deal with in the next episode as well. Enemy settlement surrenders, region has been captured. Plus command when leading infantry, morale and in battles. Congratulations to everyone involved. We got another army we can raise up. Now we just need some artillery. And then, yeah, we'll keep those guys in there. We can't get any more Wallachias. We're recovering there at that point. Why do I have two generals here? I don't know. That doesn't make a lick of sense. Uh, ba -ba -ba. There was something else I was wanting to do. Plumsy. The Austrians. They only have two regions left. French. Let's see. What do I not have researched? I have land drainage. I have Army Corps organization. Carinade. I need a f factory, okay. Join war against the Austrians. Give me carronade. Oh, I need to research that, right? I'm currently researching it. Three turns, that's still three more turns. Let's see. National leaders are not respected. We'll see about that. Uh, tech. Give me carronade, army organization, bottling and canning. Payment of a thousand. And I will join your war against the Austrians. God willing, the agreement will mark the start of many profitable exchanges. Alrighty then. Oh, I hope I just didn't screw up. Uh, Adirin, go after there. And then we desperately need a drill school. Do I have enough money for a drill school? I don't. 3,000. So what I'm going to do is under recruitment, 3,000. We're going to get ourselves a drill school. Eight turns. Should have done it a long time ago. But what we're going to do is we're going to end this episode. Where are they? There we go. How many ships do they have? They have six. We have five. I do believe our army is going to be superior. And from here, we're going to start trying to take over the seas. There's a lot of trade routes open. A lot of trade routes open that I would like to start exploiting. 
just as soon as we can get a hold of the freaking Mediterranean. Otherwise, guys, that's going to be the end of this episode. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. Haven't already hit that subscribe button. Follow me on Twitch, Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. As I mentioned, we will begin the next episode with a naval battle. Hopefully, I won't screw it up. This is Havoc, and I'm out of here. Peace.